Your important mail could be stolen without you even knowing. Thieves are targeting mailboxes across the southeast. Fueling fears Brisbane's apartment boom could lead to a spike in identity theft. Recently, police arrested a woman on the Bayside with bundles of stolen mail. It comes as Australia Post considers changing the time we get our mail delivered. Under lock and key, but even then, this bank of mailboxes is a bounty for identity thieves. You can get to 100 mailboxes rather than walk up a street with 100. Criminals have been raiding boxes in Eight Mile Plains, Runcorn and Wishart. All quick hits, bolt cutters were used to break the locks. A Medicare card gives you so many points in terms of identification. All you would need with that is a power bill, phone bill or something like that. The online economy is also forcing a rethink of parcel security. Businesses like mailboxes, etc., allow deliveries to be made to a secure location. You have someone that can sign for a package while you're at work, while you're away, while you're on holidays. But it's the humble home letterbox undergoing the biggest security upgrade. From this Bayside backyard, the Irving family build and sell their Australian parcel boxes. Nobody can reach in to steal your parcels and then access from the back via a pin-coded lock. They look like suburban mailboxes, but can hold parcels, groceries and mail securely. But they aren't the only thing evolving. 7 News understands that Australia Post is trialling early morning mail delivery. If the regime is adopted, we could soon receive our post between 7 and 9am. Australia Post is remaining tight-lipped, but so far the feedback is positive. It would allow people to clear their letterboxes before they, and identity thieves, go to work. Damien Hansen, 7 News.